My name is Lisa Roberts, and in July of 2016, I was diagnosed with inflammatory breast cancer. My husband is a healer, he's a physician, and so I do rely on him for things that are healthcare related. And um, he had done the research and said that, you know, Kirkland is doing everything that uh, any other cancer treatment place is doing here in the United States. Um, Jackson is a small community and as a result of that they kind of have small town values and I saw that more once I was diagnosed than I have the whole time that I've been living here and it has made a huge difference for me in my recovery and the way that I've uh, gotten through all of my treatment. I believe that had I been a uh, part of a larger community, a bigger city, which is actually what I'm used to, that's where I'm from, um, I really honestly do not believe that I could have gotten the same level of care. They welcomed me like they knew me, like I was family to them. Every time I come in, they're so happy to see me. They're very welcoming. Everybody runs over to you. <laughs> So happy to see you and hugging you and how have you been and oh my goodness your hair and you look great and all of all of those you know friendly warm welcoming things which is so fantastic I would have different people come with me to chemotherapy and they would al always say that this is more like a spa than it is <laughs> like some place where you would go to get treatment it all goes into um, making you feel special and attended to when you're receiving treatment there at Kirkland. By the time I got to the end of my chemotherapy, it was kind of bittersweet, you know. I should have been, of course, excited to finish treatment, but at the same time, these people had become so close to me and uh, I didn't know what I was going to do with my days and, and my time now that I didn't have to go to chemo anymore and I was going to miss everyone so much, you know. They're like family to me and if there is anyone out there who is going through the same thing that I'm going through or has the unfortunate diagnosis of having cancer, um, I would recommend that you go to Kirkland. There's no reason for you to go anywhere else.